Hello everyone, you are watching the channel Incredible Facts. The German army uses a variety of artillery systems with a focus on modernization and integration with other military technologies. In addition, the German army operates a range of air defense systems which provide protection against a range of aerial threats and are often integrated with other military technologies to create a comprehensive defense network. Today, we will show you the 10 best artillery and air defense systems of the German army built by German companies. But before we get started, if you do enjoy this video and would like to see more just like it, remember to give us a like and subscribe to our channel to get more sent straight to your notifications. FH-70 the FH-70 is a towed 155mm howitzer developed by an international consortium, which included Vickers LTD in the UK, Otto Malara in Italy, and Rheinmetall GmbH in West Germany. The standard crew for the FH-70 is 8, though it is possible to operate with a crew of only 4, albeit with much slower operations. The intention was for the FH-70 to replace the M114 155mm howitzer and equip general support battalions in German divisional artillery regiments. The propellant system comprises three different bagged cartridges with triple-base propellant, which gives a maximum range under standard conditions of 15.6 miles (24.7 kilometers). PZH-2000 The PZH-2000 Panzerhaubitz 2000 is the 155mm self-propelled howitzer developed by Krauss Maffei Wegmann together with the main subcontractor Rheinmetall Land System for the German Army. Initially, German Army planned to order a total of 1,254 new self-propelled howitzers. However, in 1996, due to the end of Cold War, a contract was signed only for 185 artillery systems. The PZH-2000 is fitted with a 155mm L-52 howitzer. The vehicle has a fully automatic loading system with ammunition management system. The PZH-2000 is compatible with standard NATO 155mm ammunition. The maximum range of fire is 18 miles 30 kilometers, with standard HE frag shell and 24 miles 40 kilometers, with base bleed shell. Using a South African VLAP rocket-assisted shell, a range of 34 miles 56 kilometers, can be achieved. The maximum rate of fire is 9 shells per minute. It can launch 3 shells within 10 seconds. This howitzer is capable of multiple round simultaneous impact firing. A total of 60 shells are stowed in the magazine. Skynex The Skynex air defense system was unveiled by Rheinmetall in November 2021. Its main armament is a 35mm Orlikon MK3 revolver gun. The system is also said to have demonstrated its ability to engage a small swarm of small aerial drones. The use of programmable 35mm ahead ammunition, as developed by Rheinmetall for this purpose, is significantly less expensive than comparable guided missile-based systems. When fired, this 35mm ammunition cannot be influenced, let alone jammed by electronic countermeasures. The gun has an effective range of 2.8 miles 4 kilometers, and a rate of fire of 1,000 rounds per minute. The gun module is equipped with an X-band tracking radar that provides an autonomous target search function, making targeting simple and fast. Tracking and destruction of an aerial object is performed automatically due to the built-in fire control processor. The system can be controlled remotely from another location. Donar The Donar 155mm self-propelled howitzer was jointly developed by Krauss Maffei Wegmann and General Dynamics. It was revealed in 2008. This artillery system was designed as faster, lighter, more powerful, and more efficient artillery system than the PZH-2000. The Donar is fitted with rotating turret, armed with a 155mm L-52 howitzer, fitted with a fully automatic ammunition loading and handling system. This self-propelled howitzer is fitted with a new automatic breech block drive. The vehicle has a crew of only two men. The maximum range of fire depends on projectile and charge combination. It is 18 miles 30 kilometers with standard and 24 miles 40 kilometers with base bleed projectile. 
using a South African VLAF rocket-assisted projectile, a range of 34 miles (56 kilometers) can be achieved. The maximum rate of fire is six rounds per minute. However, this might be increased to eight in production systems. Boxer RCH-155. The Boxer Remotely Controlled Howitzer, or RCH-155, is a self-propelled artillery system which utilizes 8x8 chassis of Boxer Armored Personnel Carrier and 155mm artillery gun module. This artillery system was developed by Kraus Maffei Wegmann as a private venture. The Boxer RCH-155 is operated by a crew of just two men. This artillery system is highly automated. It has fully automatic loading system, which loads both projectiles and charges. This artillery system is armed with a 155mm L-52 howitzer. The gun components are from the PZH-2000 howitzer. The Boxer RCH-155 also retains performance of the PZH-2000. It has a rate of fire of 6 to 8 shells per minute. This artillery system is compatible with all standard NATO 155mm projectiles. The maximum range of fire is 18 miles, 30 kilometers, with standard projectile, 24 miles, 40 kilometers, with base bleed projectile, and 34 miles, 56 kilometers, with South African VLAP rocket-assisted projectile. Sky Ranger The Sky Ranger is a mobile ground-based air defense system which can be deployed against air targets at short and very short range and against ground targets. The Sky Ranger is equipped with state-of-the-art search and tracking sensors which provide seamless 360-degree air and ground surveillance and accurate fire control data. The integrated 35mm Orlikon revolver gun provides ultimate firepower and precision. Combined with the Orlikon Ahead Airbus technology, an engagement against current and future air threats is highly effective. A typical engagement sequence consists of 20 to 24 rounds. It is effective against small and fast-moving air targets. Effective range of fire is about 2.8 miles, 4 kilometers. This artillery system has a selectable rate of fire. A maximum rate is 1,000 rounds per minute. It is also capable of firing mini bursts or single shots. A total of 220 rounds are carried for the main gun. Gepard the Gepard self-propelled anti-aircraft gun was developed in the 1960s as a private venture. It entered service with the Bundeswehr in 1973 as the Flakpanzer I Gepard. A total of 420 of these vehicles were built for the German Army. The vehicle is fitted with twin Orlikon GDF 35mm guns. These guns are belt-fed. Maximum rate of fire for a single gun is 550 rounds per minute. Ammunition load of the Gepard consists of 640 armor-piercing incendiary rounds for firing against air targets and 40 armor-piercing rounds against ground targets. The radar of the Gepard has a range of 9.5 miles (15 kilometers). It provides all-round scanning with simultaneous target tracking. The hull of the Gepard provides protection against small-caliber cannons while turret protection is only against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. The Gepard has a crew of three, including commander, gunner, and driver. Lars II The Lars II is an upgraded variant of the original Lars multiple launch rocket system. Between 1980 and 1983, all 209 original Lars systems were upgraded to the Lars II standard. This multiple launch rocket system played an important role with German Army's artillery forces. In 1998, the last Lars II was phased out from active service in favor of the US M270 MLRS. The launcher has two packs with a total of 36 tubes for 110mm rockets. The Lars II fired improved rockets fitted with newly developed warheads. These rockets had a maximum range of 11 to 16 miles. 19 to 25 kilometers. The vehicle was fitted with 7.62 millimeter machine gun for self-protection and limited air defense capability. The Lars II was reloaded manually. It took about 15 to 20 minutes. Skyguard 3 The Orlikon Skyguard 3 air defense system is the third generation of the legendary Skyguard air defense product line. 
With its two 35mm Orlikon twin gun GDF-009, it is optimized for the protection of stationary high-value assets such as airfields, bridges, industrial installations, and military command and control centers. Its main purpose is the effective area and point defense against all types of air threats, including cruise missiles and high-speed missiles with small radar cross-section, as well as medium and low-level aircraft, helicopters, and unmanned aerial vehicles attacking by day and by night and under all weather conditions. The SkyGuard combines state-of-the-art target detection, tracking sensors, sophisticated fire control and ballistic computation with the twin gun's accuracy and high rate of fire of up to 1,100 rounds per minute. Iris TSLM The Iris TSLM air defense system was a result of a German-led multinational program. Dial Defense was the main developer. Other partner countries include Greece, Italy, Norway, and Sweden. This air defense system was developed to meet requirements of German Federal Ministry of Defense. This system provides protection against fighter aircraft, helicopters, cruise missiles, short-range ballistic missiles, drones. The Iris T missiles have high speed, sophisticated electronics, and unmatched maneuverability. Missiles utilize infrared homing in terminal phase. This means that the Iris T missile tracks its targets by following their heat signature. However, unlike many other contemporary missiles, the Iris T has a high definition image processing system and can see the target. This allows to distinguish between countermeasures such as flares and blinding lasers and its target. Missiles are launched vertically and are steered towards the target after launch so the vertical launcher provides 360-degree coverage. That's all, friends. Thanks for watching. Write in the comments which of the artillery and air defense systems you like the most. Also, click the like button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any new interesting videos.